So I'm going for a walk with my mum and we're going to look at the hedgerow, see the sort of thing that you can eat if you're lost in the wilderness. Not much of a wilderness to be fair, but uh, if you ever do get lost and you're in a back road and there's people nearby, but you're a little bit peckish, these are things you can eat or help you to get better if you've cut yourself or, or you've got a cold or I don't know, various other things. This is plantain which I've been told is very good for all sorts of remedies for things. Bruises and I don't know, expectorant. It's good if you've got a cold. Very nutritious apparently. So if you ever get lost in the wild and you need something to eat there's medicine and food for you there. Ooh. Crows. Blackberry. Later on in the year they'll have lots of blackberries on that so you can eat those too. No need to starve if you live on the road. Nettles, very good. Blood purifying. Be very careful, they're obviously a bit spiky if you eat them raw. Dandelions. You can eat the root of those, they're very good for the liver. Quite nice as a salad, the leaves. A little bit bitter, but edible. Dock leaves, also very good for purifying. And also, if you've been stung by the nettle, get a dock leaf, less of a sting. There's more plantain there. You see the flower? That's what you're looking for. You can eat the leaves. I suppose you can eat the flower. I don't know. Probably not that nice. Lots of nettles, lots of big tall dock, lots of buttercups, which don't taste of butter very disappointingly, but I'm sure at a pinch you could eat them. Clover, which is good if you're feeding cattle. I don't know whether people can eat them. I'll probably have to look that up. There you are. They're not ready yet, but that's wild strawberries. Mmm. Really no need to go to the supermarket. So are you a wise woman? Pardon? Are you a wise woman? A wage? A, a wise, wise woman. woman. Yes. Yes, of course Absolutely. you are. So you can tell us all about the various <laughs> remedies well, in probably, the wild. I was probably a witch in my previous life. Mm. That was after I was a road builder in Turkey. Oh right, well, <laughs> reincarnation, eh? Yep. Oh, Lovely. Yes, I, I believe in it. Well, that's handy. Yeah. Oh, oh, look, look, look over here. Fuchsia. Now, you don't necessarily get these in the wild, but they're sort of in the wild here. But you can eat the berries of those. The berries haven't come yet, but you can make a nice pie. Obviously, in the wild, you'd have to make a little fire first to make a pie. And obviously, you'd have to wait. But these bits here... Oops, I've broken the fuchsia. Oh, dear. When they get big and plump, quite tasty with a lot of sugar and uh, other things. Probably not on their own. That's a lovely clematis, but I don't think you can eat that. Hawthorn, also known as, what's it called? Nuts and, what would you call it? Bread and butter. Bread and butter, yeah. Bread and butter. Tastes like, uh, doesn't taste like bread and butter actually. Okay. Taste of leaf. This is belladonna, deadly nightshade. Deadly nightshade, so don't eat them because they're very bad for you. People in the Middle Ages used to put them, well women, used to put them in their eyes to make their eyes big and bright and sparkly and then they go blind. So don't do that. A, a form of uh, a white What form. is that? Sorry, what is that? Old man's beard they call it, but it's a form of clematis. A white... There's a snail, you can eat snails. You get horrible intestinal parasites and die in agony, but you can eat them if you want. I don't know where they came from, but it appears to be a black currant. Oh, black currant, nice. Well, that's a good handy place to have and a black currant. Berry. And blackberries. Yeah, blackberries are everywhere, but not black currant. And, and what's and, that? Uh, nut tree. Uh, no. Oh, hazelnuts. hazelnuts. See, you've got three courses blackberries, <laughs> black currants, and hazelnuts. Oh, the bounty. Oh, and you can. Is that ivy? Or is that deadly nightshade again? This? What's this? Is this deadly nightshade again? No. What's this? Ivy. Oh, ivy. See, the ivy berries look a lot like deadly nightshade and they're probably just as unpleasant. Don't eat them. What do they? Well, if you're a bird, eat the ivy. 
there's a lot there's, there's blackberries yeah again yeah blackberries nice what yeah. else and then there's raspberries that have grown wild on, on oh. this patch here nice that's raspberries then yeah mm. and there's pine you can't eat pine can you you can smell it What's what? Oh, no, elderflower. Elderflower! Yes, elderflower. You can make elderflower champagne, you can wait for the berries, make elderberry wine, all oh, sorts no, of... Oh tell a lie. Oh, is it? What is it? What is it then? I'm telling fibs. You're telling fibs? You're telling me fibs? You're telling everyone fibs? <laughs> yeah, not, You're trying to poison not, people? We used to have, we used to have an Alright, what is that then? Oh, that is, What's that then? That is, that is a, a mountain ash. Oh, don't eat that then. <laughs> Oh, hopeless. Potatoes. You can eat potatoes. You have to dig them up first. Make sure they're not all green. They'll poison you. All together, a bountiful paradise. A bountiful harvest. Yes, you needn't go any further. Bye-bye. <laughs>